Carbon is an essential element for all life forms on Earth. It's in a constant state of movement, from reservoir to reservoir, to form the carbon cycle. Carbon cycles between these pools to help life to evolve as we know it. It makes its way through the hydrosphere, atmosphere, ocean sphere, geosphere, pedosphere, and biosphere. Carbon is pulled from the atmosphere to the biosphere through photosynthesis. Carbon dioxide and light is used by plants to make the sugars they need to grow. Carbon moves throughout the biosphere by travelling through the food chain. Animals feed on plants and then get eaten by bigger animals. When plants or animals die, they decompose and the carbon moves down into the pedosphere. Some of that carbon is buried and will become a fossil fuel in millions of years. When we burn fossil fuels, large amounts of carbon are mined from the pedosphere and emitted into the atmosphere as carbon dioxide, releasing historic carbon. Animals and plants also produce carbon dioxide through a process called respiration. This releases carbon from the biosphere into the atmosphere. A significant amount of atmospheric carbon is absorbed by the surface water of the world's oceans, joining the ocean sphere. Some of the carbon is removed from the ocean when the shells and bones of marine animals and plankton are deposited on the seafloor. Over a period of time, these deposits create limestone, locking carbon within the seabed. This carbon is released back into the atmosphere if the limestone dissolves or remains buried deep within the Earth's crust to join the geosphere. Over millions of years, carbon in the geosphere is slowly weathered away, running off into surface water catchments to rejoin the hydrosphere. To find out more about carbon and how it is important to our region, visit our website.